I walked into my local game store today and I was very surprised to find five dollar magic cards for the first time in over a year. This makes me happy because I am broke as fuck. Now the set boosters are still seven to eight bucks and the special packs are like thirty dollars still but that's a drastic change from the last three or four sets that have come out in the past year, two years. And of course the decks have not gone down in value. They're about $60 still. That's better than at least the last set. I know, I know the last couple sets were special edition sets, but God, I have not seen these prices since Dungeons and Dragons sets came out. March of the Machines was cheaper, but the last several sets have been eight to twenty dollars for a regular pack. I don't know what Wizards of the Coast is thinking. I can't pay for those. I wasn't even able to get the last set. I wanted to. There were some really good cards that I really wanted to get, but they were twenty dollars a pack. And then the Lord of the Rings sets were almost ten dollars a pack. And then the set before that was cheaper. It was March of the Machines, but the last five sets have been seven to twenty dollars a piece for a regular booster pack of 15 cards. And yes, I know I'm repeating myself, but I am very happy to see that Wizards of the Coast is finally putting the prices down just a bit. Because this is insane. Pokemon has not gone up in value since I feel like 2018. I have not seen Pokemon go up in value at all. None of their packs. They're $5 packs. They've been $5 packs for almost a decade. I remember going into the store and buying Pokemon cards for 5 bucks when I was 15. Maybe 13. Oh my god. I hate inflation. I hate... I, I hate all this uh, bullshit that Wizards of the Coast is doing with their magic decks. A deck for the last set was over a hundred dollars for a deck. That's insane. Wizards of the Coast, if you are here right now watching this, you probably aren't. But please, stop putting out special edition packs because I can't buy them and it's really annoying. I cannot fuel my Magic the Gathering addiction. When I saw those packs on the shelf, I, I didn't even realize they were going up. I, I, I wasn't catching up on this because these packs have been so expensive in the past. So I, I just thought I was just gonna give up on Magic for, for a while. But when I saw those on the shelf, I rushed to my car to get my wallet. But when I grabbed my wallet, I was specifically told by family to not buy magic cards right now because I don't have the money. I am very excited for Wilds of Eldraine, their new set, and I would love to check it out. Please don't raise the prices. Please. I don't get paid enough for you to raise the prices. And I will see you later.